Good morning, Cupcakes. It is a beautiful morning here in Suffertown. I hope your day is going wonderfully. And to start off the day, we've got the bazaar starting in about three and a half hours, I believe. And after that, we're not. there's not going to be a whole lot. I don't think we have any birthdays or any events going on. But we will be having, well, not any festivals going on, sorry. We will be uh, trying to trigger one of a couple of random events. And uh, by the way, I guess I should mention that if things go how I think they're going to go, then I am sorry for the clickbait thumbnail. I thought it would be amusing. Anyway. I think we're pretty good here. We don't have... Yeah, we don't have the dog bone, so we can't actually... Uh, it's a habit, putting that away. But I think it's one that we don't really need to be doing anymore. Or at least not during the winter. Because we don't really have a whole lot that we're bringing over to the bazaar. We've got just over a page worth of stuff that we're going to be bringing over to sell at the bazaar. Well... We're also going to be stopping off it. And here's Sherry, coming out in the cold while she is pregnant, to head to the bazaar. Anyway, oops. So we're going to go ahead and do our forage route. And there actually are a few other things, because we need to pick up some stuff at the windmills. So there's that, but we really aren't bringing a whole lot. And I forgot the hammer. So again, you know, since we don't really need to be... Look, can you just stay over here, please? Since we don't really need to be bringing a lot of stuff to the bazaar, we don't really need to be shoving our entire inventory into storage anymore. And hopefully Lloyd will sell gold this week and we can make some gold coins. That would be nice. It's really not worth it to make silver coins just because of the fact that gold is just only slightly... Uh, well, he's got copper, so that'll be nice. You can make plenty of copper coins then. Let's see. Is there anything else that I uh, wanted to check? No, I don't think... I don't think there's anything we need to check for store inventories. Let's open our stand. Are we even going to be able to fill this stand? With our stuff? Barely. Yeah. Everything that we're selling this week is, is going on our stand right now. Meowies! Well, I mean, until we check out the lotto and the super lucky lotto. Oh, sorry. Oh, and she bought both of them too. Wow. Did not see ya. But in spite of the fact that we're not selling a whole lot, we already reached 100,000 in sales. Ah, jewelry. The life of a jeweler. I ain't going back to farming. Wool. Milk. Eggs. Scrap metal. I think what I'm going to need to start doing is I'm going to start needing to turn some of my eggs into various other things and just take the loss just so that I don't have to sit here and wait for 70 eggs. A 70 stack of eggs to sell. How are things going, right? Busy, you want to help out? I'm working hard, I want to go home. Uh, gee, I wonder which one is the positive one. I'm working hard. Great to hear. Keep what is this feeling? It's as though this ball of wool is calling to me. Mm, I wonder why. Then I'll double the price. <laughs> you can have it for free. Oh, fine. He can have it for free. What? I can? Thank you. Even though we're not going to win on reputation this week, because we just don't have enough stuff to sell. We don't have enough opportunities for people to come by and say, Hey, give me free stuff. I 
I guess what I could do is I could start giving the eggs away. Even if it's only an okay gift, that still raises your friendship 50 friendship points, which is... I mean, you do that two days, then that's the equivalent of talking to them for an extra day. Ah, good to see you, Ray. Would you happen to know where the mayor is? He's up and to the left. I see. Thank you. Let's see, we're at 30 and we only have... Well, okay, actually. Sorry. Eder, could you tell me where the laughing stall is? What? The laughing stall? Rapping stall? Go left. Thanks, one second. Ah, that's better. My false teeth fell out. My false teeth fell out. No wonder no one could understand me. Eggs. So many eggs. We actually might get... Oh, wait. Okay, never mind. Not so many eggs. I guess we'll take a break. I was gonna say we might actually get third. There is a chance, but not a very good chance. Alright, Lloyd. Give me lots and lots of copper. How does 40 sound? I mean, we have a lot of coins to be turning into copper, and we don't really have much use for this money. Except to buy recipes and all that. Hello there. Welcome to Isaac's Info Center. Would you like to know all kinds of inside info, Ray? Sure. Well, this is just a rumor, really. Hmm? Why am I in charge of running the info center? Well, there's a lot of reasons, actually. And they're all secret. <laughs> if any other hot info comes along, you'll suddenly... <laughs> what hot info did I hear about this time? <laughs> nice. Alright. Five bronze coins. Oh man, so much for the luckiest file. Hey, well, I don't think I've seen you come by these streams before. Okay, then let's see just how lucky you are. Fourth place prize. Well, we'll actually, that'll actually increase our chances of getting third place. Uh, we can't turn that into jewelry, so we might as well sell it as is. I think there's a, um, a birthday coming up in this next week, but I forget whose it is. Can't do any wrapping. First ticket. First place prize already. Olive oil, nice. I believe olive oil is what you use to make pickles. And pickles are actually quite a profitable way to sell veggies. Uh, second one, a loss. Third one, a loss. It's just taunting me now. Second place prize, good butter. I think that actually might pay... The good butter and the olive oil together might pay for our tickets. So three losses and two pretty darn good wins, actually. Let's see, I think we have both of those wonderfuls, and we're not going to get the ruby, so... Welcome, welcome. Would you like our fortune, Red? It's just 100G. Sure, tell me my fortune. Abracadabra. What fate lies in wait for you? Relaxing is nice, but try adding some excitement to your life. So, did that enlighten you at all? Feel free to come back anytime. I think you already told me that before. Nothing that we want uh, from Felix. Let's see what you've got, Joan. Pizza, milk stew, and... I don't have the recipe for curly, curry dumpling. All those curry dumplings that we've been getting in the... in the snowballs. Don't have a recipe for it. Interesting. Is that... is that corn soup and raclettes again? Why? Ay ay ay. 
A lot of skill, not a lot of creativity. I think we've already tried giving people milk stew before, so let's try the curry dumplings. And then... What was... What was Claire selling again? What was this in the middle? Miso soup. I don't think we've tried giving people miso soup. I could be wrong on this, but we'll give this one a shot too. And then we have quite a lot of money left over. Maybe we'll get some corn soup. Just because we can. That is plenty of stuff that we're getting, and then we're gonna go ahead and have some nice curry dumpling with our tea. Mm, delicious. And we'll go ahead and try giving people miso soup. See how they like it. Hello there, eh? Feel free to ask me any questions. For me, thanks. Hello there, Ray. Are you eating well? I really like this, thanks. Yeah, she likes soups. Oh, Ray. Hello. For me? Thanks. If you made it this far in the video, don't forget to like it if you haven't already, to subscribe to this channel if you aren't already, and to let me know any thoughts you have down below. I especially appreciate that last one, but all of it really helps me out, and it helps my videos show up in your inbox more consistently, so do not forget. Hey there, what are you doing? Wait, shouldn't you be, like, working? I'll take it, I guess. Oh. Okay. So, we finally found a food item that Cindy doesn't like. We just had to go all the way to the Far East for it. What else are we gonna do on a bazaar? Oh, wait! What else are we gonna do on a bazaar day? That's right. Sell the stuff that I said we were gonna sell. Oh my goodness. Uh... So that's 800 and 670. So actually, it came close to paying for our tickets. Butter, olive oil, scrap metal, agates. I can't go on. Oh no, no, you know what? No. No way. Oh my, what a horrible, uncaring person you are. No, screw you. No, no. You just want a free agate. No, no, no. That ain't happening, okay? I ain't gonna be winning on reputation by giving away an agate. Listen, if this was another time, maybe. But we weren't gonna be winning on reputation anyway. So, so seriously, I don't... It, it's... This, it's not gonna help you go on, okay? Oh wait, no. We don't want to give Stuart the miso soup. Good afternoon, eh? You look well. Why, thank you. That's very kind. Yes! Oh my goodness. Trying to find something that- something to eat that Ethel likes is very, very difficult. So, unless Kevin is secretly a huge fan of miso soup, which I doubt, but I suppose that's possible. Uh, we aren't going to be... This is nobody's favorite gift, but most people like it well enough. Oh, re I'm sleepy. For me, thanks. I don't see people's evening dialogue very often because we usually don't talk to them for the first time in the evening. Great! Looks like everybody is here! It's time to announce the bizarre results! Our top three earners in third place with 146,620 G! Yes! Ray, congratulations! Just barely managed to sneak in there. In second place with 174,000 G! Jones Store, congratulations! And in first place with 254,000 G! 
Rose Store. Congratulations! And the person with the happiest customers was... Roll! The customer said your service was top-notch! <laughs> you more than a down proud! Keep up the good work! For being in the top three, Ray will receive a token of thanks! A good herb mayonnaise! I hope you like it! I will be selling it at the very next bazaar. Our goal to be the best bazaar in the world is now still out of reach. Some of you are worried. We've just got to keep at it. Our goal for the next bazaar is 150,000 to 200,000 G. We can do it. Well, that's all for now. Start getting ready for the next bazaar. Yeah, like my Felix voice is like is the reason why like 90% of people who watch my videos watch them. So so the event that we're going to be trying to trigger, it doesn't start until tomorrow. Well, I mean, it doesn't start showing up until tomorrow. I th think it's like Monday... I don't know. Yes, this is me. Thanks. Hey there, what are you doing? Are you, shouldn't you be, like, working? Thanks. I'm impressed that you know what I like. Does that mean you'll stop pranking me and blaming it on Kevin? Um, hello. Is this for me? Th thank you very much. It's looking like corn soup is another one of those that's liked by... Actually, I think almost everyone. <laughs> I don't... Did... Did Claude even dislike the corn soup? I think it was just Amir that didn't like it. Huh. So yeah, it's it's liked by basically everyone. Uh, let's go ahead and have a scone with our tea. Thank you. I hope you like it. Oh, whoops. And let's go ahead and have our tea. Mmm. Delicious. I love scones. Um... It's kind of like like a muffin, except for denser and smaller. Oh, we forgot to feed our horse. Oh, uh, actually, I think I might have left something in the cafe. Hold on. Let's let our horse eat, and then we'll go and check it. How's it going? I'm about to pass out from hunger. Huh? Dirk, you remember our bet, right? Our bet? Oh, right, right. I lost, so I have to buy you lunch, right? Yes. I've skipped meals just to prepare. What? Hey, a bet's a bet. Now feed me. Ugh, fine. Come over here. Yes! Here's an omelette rice. Go for it. <laughs> this looks great. Another, please. Already? What? Did you even chew that? Yeah, kinda. Fine, I'll bring something else out. another helping, but larger this time. Well, thanks, Marion. Here's another one. Chew this time. Here I go. Great, bring another. <sighs> Man, I'm stuffed. That was great. Well, I think he's finally done. Um, how much do I owe? A month's salary? Oh, man. <laughs> well, I'm done here. Later, guys.
And yes, Angelo does lose husband O points for the pettiness that is that. Go. Never lose a bet with Angelo. That's the lesson here. My goodness. All right, curry dumpling, another one on the list of lots of people like it, but it's nobody's favorite. Hey. But that's fine. I mean, the fact of the matter is that we are increasing friendship with the people in town through this through this uh, um, yeah. quest. Even though sometimes we, you know, we hit a miss and somebody doesn't like a gift or two or three. Um, most of most of the time, on a on the average, we are increasing friendship. With every, with pretty much everybody in town, I think Claude and Ethel were probably not doing very well with with this. Apparently, n neither of them liked like really any cooked dish, but for the most part, it's 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 working out well. And Ethel likes flowers, and Claude likes blue magic flowers, so we can recover our friendship with them pretty pretty quickly, and we can raise it pretty quickly, so. Shouldn't be an issue for, for those two. And for the rest, well, like I said, we're increasing our friendship with them. I think that's gonna have to be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Again, sorry about the clickbait thumbnail. And I hope the rest of your day is a good one, and I hope that I will see you later. Bye. A man died in the Union by the name of McNabb They washed him and laid him outside on a slab And after the coroner his measures did take His wife took him home to a bloody fine wake Twas about twelve o'clock and the beer it was high The corpse he sat up and he says with a sigh I can't get to heaven, they won't let me up Till I bring them a pint of the Johnny Jump Up Oh never, oh never, oh never again If I live to a hundred or a hundred and ten Cause I fell to the ground and I couldn't get up After drinking a pint of that Johnny Jump Up